And I would like to welcome our expert panelists who will share with us their views about the role of the federal government to advance electricity production from the nuclear power and its ability to help address the pressing problems of climate change. There is no doubt we are witnessing a renewed interest in nuclear power production overseas and here in the U.S. Controls of greenhouse gra gas emissions, federal incentives authorized in the Energy Policy Act of 2005, and higher fossil fuel prices are all motivating this renewed interest. The Nuclear Regulatory Commission is anticipating over 30 U.S. applications for new reactors through 2009, and another 150 are planned or proposed globally. Existing nuclear power plants provide approximately 20 percent of our nation's electricity, and they do so as a carbon or low-carbon emitter. Improvements in performance at our nuclear facilities over the years have made them a reliable source of baseload electricity. However, expanded use of nuclear power won't come without some major cost. Construction of new nuclear power plants is expensive. In addition, other issues that need to be considered are the risk of nuclear weapons proliferation, management of radioactive waste generated by the nuclear power, and the cost to the taxpayers of possible additional federal subsidies to the industry. The technical challenges of expanded nuclear power production should be met with an aggressive research and development program. The administration has been a strong advocate of expanded financial support for the industry. In my view, support for research and development to address the challenges associated with expanded nuclear power production is equally important. I believe that we must maintain a, diver a diverse and robust energy production portfolio in the United States. We need reliable and affordable electricity generation to maintain our quality of life and ensure we remain globally competitive. We must have a strategy that maintains our economic viability without turning a blind eye to the tremendous challenge of climate change. The details of a national climate change program are not very clear, but I believe it is critical that we have a comprehensive and meaningful technology strategy to ensure we can meet targeted reductions of greenhouse gas emissions in a rapid time frame. I look forward to a lively discussion this morning uh, about the potential for nuclear power to provide more of our electricity in the United States and abroad. And at this time, I would like to yield to my friend, the distinguished uh, colleague from California, uh, and our, our uh, today's ranking uh, member um, for his opening statement.